Home. Later, Seth had a son and named him Enosh. About this time, people started worshiping the Lord. Genesis 5. God created men and women to be like himself. He gave them his blessing and called them human beings. This is a list of the descendants of Adam, the first man. When Adam was 130, he had a son who was just like him, and he named him Seth. Adam had more children and died at the age of 930. When Seth was 105, he had a son named Enosh. Seth had more children and died at the age of 912. When Enosh was 90, he had a son named Kenan. Enosh had more children and died at the age of 905. When Kenan was 70, he had a son named Mahalalo. Kenan had more children and died at the age of 910. When Mahalalo was 65, he had a son named Jared. Mahalalo had more children and died at the age of 895. When Jared was 162, he had a son named Enoch. Jared had more children and died at the age of 962. When Enoch was 65, he had a son named Methuselah. And during the next 300 years, he had more children. Enoch truly loved God, and God took him away at the age of 365. When Methuselah was 187, he had a son named Lamech. Methuselah had more children, and died at the age of 969. When Lamech was 182, he had a son. Lamech said, I'll name him Noah, because he will give us comfort as we struggle hard to make a living on this land that the Lord has put under a curse. Lamech had more children and died at the age of 777. After Noah was 500 years old, he had three sons and named them Shem, Ham, and Japheth. Genesis 6 More and more people were born until finally they spread all over the earth. Some of their daughters were so beautiful that supernatural beings came down and married the ones they wanted. Then the Lord said, I won't let my life giving breath remain in any one forever. No one will live for more than 120 years. The children of the supernatural beings who had married these women became famous heroes and warriors. They were called Nephilim and lived on the earth at that time and even later. The Lord saw how bad the people on earth were and that everything they thought and planned was evil. He was very sorry that he had made them and he said, I'll destroy every living creature on earth. I'll wipe out people, animals, birds, and reptiles. I'm sorry I ever made them. But the Lord was pleased with Noah, and this is the story about him. Noah was the only person who lived right and obeyed God. He had three sons, Shem, Ham, and Japheth. God knew that everyone was terribly cruel and violent, so he told Noah, Cruelty and violence have spread everywhere. Seven pounds.